Well, I grew up in Anniston, Alabama, and my dad was a Coca-Cola bottler. We moved to Pensacola in 1967. I was not a very good golfer, but I wanted to play golf in college. My dad was responsible, along with three other bottling groups in Alabama, that came together as a consortium that helped support and sponsor the Bear Bryant Show. So he knew Preacher Franklin, who was one of Coach Bryant's good friends, and so he asked Preacher to ask Coach, could he please help me with a scholarship? Uh, I was not a very good player, and uh, but because of the Coca-Cola connection with the Bear Bryant Show, and Coach was the uh, Coach Bryant was the athletic director, they ended up giving me, I think, meals and books my freshman year. Well, I really didn't ever think I was going to be good enough to be a pro golfer. I wanted to be one, but I was not a good player. When I qualified to play the U.S. Amateur at the start of my senior year, I had no idea I was going to win it. And so my goal then was to become a professional golfer. So I didn't go to school. I didn't graduate. Coach Bryant would always call me until he died. And, and I spent a lot of time with him. He said, pro, you got to get your college degree. It means a lot to the University of Alabama. And finally, in 1997, when my daughter came up to freshman orientation. Susie, my wife, and I were driving back with Jenny. And she said, I'm going to have the first degree from the University of Alabama. And I thought about it. It kind of bugged me because I'm so competitive. I joined the arts and science external degree program. And, and I set it up where I could come back and graduate with my daughter. We walked through graduation in 2001 with our caps and gowns on, and unfortunately, the bet she had with me, she won because they called Jenny Pate before they called Jerry Pate. I was always the guy on the PGA Tour. When Alabama did anything in sports, it was a Bear Bryant story, a Gene Stalling story. Everybody in the locker room say, hey, that's your team. You know, did you hear about this? Alabama, to me, was probably the most important part of my career and my life, other than meeting my wife and having my children. I learned more in those last four years, doing those last 30 hours, than I learned in my whole life. Coach Bryant, he says, I want you to act well, I want you to speak well, and I want you to dress well and represent the University of Alabama with class. And he always meant that. 